Hello everybody, this is Holland Hunt here, and welcome back to another Graveyard Review, and this Graveyard Review is on the Jemmy Spirit Halloween 5 foot life-size talking bony Tony with Mike. Now, I bought this prop, as I said, in Spirit Halloween for 2016, actually at the clearance sale for about $50, and as you can see, this prop is a really cool prop. I mean, um, I want to give into some facts and details about him, so let's start. But before we do, let's start with the box. Here's Bony Tony's box. It is five foot tall, eyes and body light up, speaks, speaks three spooky phrases. How about, how about spaghetti more, please? And where's my mom, my mommy? It says spirit, life size talking skeleton. The, the box has the new front for 2017, and there's the top. This is the same on the side, it says it's just life size talking skeleton. And then, uh, same with the other side. Now let's move to the back, and it says five foot tall, the same thing, wires, mic included. Mouth synced, you know, safety warning, mouth synced with the microphone. And now here's Bony Tony himself. Now, I really like this prop a lot, but I also kind of dislike him. I'll tell you why. First of all, his quality is kind of cheap, I'll say. Um, not really good quality. And there's the spine, light up spine, you know. The, mine was actually, uh, this was, these clips were made before he actually broke a little bit, like he broke. Um, he broke a bit, sadly. Um, he's like, uh, I mean, this, oh, I'm just showing you some zooms. That's the part where it broke, um, before he broke a lot. Like, his spine kind of cracked, so I had to glue that. And then his, uh, he didn't, microphone didn't work, so I had to fix that up. Um, and there's the spine. Um, it works now, though. I mean, not the microphone, I mean, the spine didn't light up, so I fixed that. And there's the back, there's not a uh, cap to his head yet, I didn't put it on during that video. But, here he is. His detail is okay, I mean, the detail is kind of the north ball, as you can see that middle pole. You can actually see through him. Uh, you can see the light up spine pretty well, which is kind of weird. And, this guy is really cool, but as I just said before, um, his... He looks kind of weird, but the thing I like about him the most, of course, is the microphone option. And he's r posable skeleton, like a posable skeleton, you can see him posing it. Uh, so if you're working for a posable skeleton, this is like probably a good one for you. So yeah, I would definitely recommend that. Bony Tony does have, um, he looks like a regular skeleton. And then there's that pole in the middle. You can actually remove that, so you can make actually have Bony Tony sit if you just take that pole out. You can actually have him sit down because, it's, you know, he didn't need anything uh, wire or mechanic glass for the uh, bottom, and there's his mouth, his speakers on the top, which is really cool. Here's a demo of him. <laughs> so, as you can see there, he's a really cool prop. I mean, Yes, you can hear the speakers kind of muffled up, which is the only thing I could complain about. But as I said before, I really like the microphone option on him, which is the only reason why I really did probably get him. Um, so now I'm going to rate Bony Tony on five uh, five ratings. Detail, animation, appearance, durability, and price. Detail, he's going to get a half a star just because he's not really, or well, half a pumpkin just because he's not really has much detail on him, but he's still really cool, and he, he might, you know, be considered a skeleton, he really do. I'll give him, uh, a star for animation, I mean, it's not really supposed to do anything besides move the mouth, which is pretty good. The appearance, he's got really good appearance for kids and stuff. Durability, I'll give half the star just because it's not really good durability. And then I'll give a star for the price. So the total, Bony Tony's gonna get a 4 out of 5 pumpkins. Bony Tony has a really cool prop, I think he's okay though. Not the best, probably certainly not the worst. I do like him a lot. Um, he's got like he's like a bobblehead type skeleton. And he's kind of cheaply made, but I do like the microphone option. So you can definitely have anything you want to say on Halloween for him. Uh, his price was good for what I got him for. I mean, hundred dollars really originally is not really a good price, but for what I got him for, it's pretty good. Bony Tony's mic option. That's a really cool option. As you can see here, you can actually talk into the skeleton yourself. I'm not using my mic to record it, I'm usually using my, the uh, microphone it came with to show you what it sounds like and what it does. It talks. Um, I would recommend talking close to it because if you talk far away, you can't really get any signal. As you can see, it's not really a good signal. If you do it kind of closer, you can get some signal. Uh, make sure not to do it close here because if you do that, see how it squeaks. So make sure you're kind of far away. 
It does have a wire, so you can actually move around the places. I recommend moving maybe somewhere far away from the prop, so no one really expects it, maybe. I mean, you can see the cord, so it kind of gives it away, though. Um, but it's a really cool prop. I think a 4 out of 5 pumpkins is what you can get, because just for the quality and the speaker, it's just not really that great. But of course, it's still pretty cool. So yes, yeah, so I hope you enjoy this review. Make sure you subscribe to Halloween Haunted today, and this is Halloween Haunted. Mm -hmm.